so it's almost back to school season, which means it's time to go back to the sweltering heat of the classroom. <laughs> something that I always struggled with in middle school is dress code. As a woman, receiving the education that I'm legally entitled to, it's really, really important to make sure that the boys don't get distracted while they're receiving theirs. So, you know, I think it's our job to dress code ourselves. So today, you're in luck, I'm going to show you exactly how to make your favorite summer outfits dress code appropriate so that you're going unnoticed in the classroom. So the first outfit, wow, so this maxi dress is so cute and it's so flattering but unfortunately it's just not long enough and also has a big slit up the side which is not good at all. You don't want boys to be seeing your legs. Sorry, that was inappropriate. Also it's spaghetti straps and it shows the smallest amount of cleavage. Are you kidding me? So I think that a really easy fix for this is to just layer, layer, layer. And I know it's August or September, but still, you know, it's kind of your fault that you are a woman, so. Um, one of my favorite layering pieces is a cute baseball tee. It's still sporty and fashionable, easy for school, and it's three-quarter sleeves, so not quite long sleeves. We're not fully going in there. And another essential layering piece is leggings, because, you know, you should never wear leggings by yourself ever and also you know it'll make sure that it's longer and it covers that horrible slit up the side of it so this outfit is another really really cute one so first of all we have this adorable um tank top from the gap that's really really cute it has lace on the back and it's just like a nice cute basic but it is far too inappropriate you're showing your shoulders and your cleavage what are you even doing the first thing that suggests for this outfit is you know you might want to put on another sports bra because it's definitely your fault that you have boobs and flatten out your chest, you know, a little more than, uh, than you had before. Yeah, as for the jeans, they're too ripped. They should, the rips are just too close to the thigh. You, whoa, they're so, the rip should be past your fingertips. For this look, I might suggest just putting on, um, a pair of, like, spandex or legging just to like hide the skin so you don't see it in the rips put on a jean jacket because you know denim on denim is a really cute look so you've got your, your jacket on and you might want to might want to button it up a little bit just to prevent anything from happening down here and also your shoulders are covered too so it's better and also you can't see your bra straps because boys can't know that you wear a bra so yeah um make sure not to get dress coated on the first day of school it's really important I would just wear a turtleneck and like some like really baggy pants and a sweater so and like two sports three sports I would be safe and go with three sports bras sometimes you you never know I'll see you guys next week with some more fun back to school